collectively football writers, football fans going to handle Manziel because it can't be front page news every time the guy goes on vacation. Well, I think a lot of it is up to him. I mean, if he's out there and he's in the public, he's taking it out of our hands. I mean, TMZ is out there, fans are out there with their phones. You know, if he's doing stuff, it's whether we report on it or not, it's going to be talked about. I mean, I think he has to make the decision once I get the training camp, do I want to settle down and just, you know, concentrate on football? Because you can do that. You see with teams like the Patriots and other teams, if he wants to do that, he can. The question is, does he want to? Or does he want to be the, the, the first TMZ sports star? I don't know. Yeah, and I think there's so many questions about him translating to the NFL in a couple ways. One, obviously, is his playing style on the field, but the other half is his personality. And, you know, is he going to be able to hunker down? Will he have the – does he have the makeup to be the franchise-type quarterback you see? So I think – the reason these off the field events are news with him is because that is such a big question mark. So like Greg said, sort of up to him and how he kind of chooses to what light he chooses to put that transition in. Yeah. I think it's important to remember that a lot of rookies are doing the same things that he's doing, but they're not under the same kind of spotlight that he's under because of his reputation from college, because, you know, he's drafted as a quarterback in the first round. You're not seeing Teddy Bridgewater. Um, scrutinized the same way you are Johnny Manziel just because of the, their backstories are so much different. I Teddy Bridgewater's in Vegas or, you know, posting videos of him throwing footballs on a lake or anything like that. Johnny is inviting this. And yes, he has a pr higher profile, uh, so he has to deal with other things. But that's part of the deal. He created this. He has to realize this and he has to adjust. I, you know, I do think a lot of the other guys are anonymous and that helps for them. But, you know, Johnny knows what he's doing. This is not by accident. And yeah. seems to thrive in this role as oh, well. Yeah. Do you think in some ways he kind of needs everyone talking about him, proving him wrong to kind of have that chip on his shoulder? Huh? That's the that's the question. And, 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 you know, I think the bigger question is, you know, how is, is – and this was the question going into the draft, and I heard this from an NFL coach. He said, you know, I love him as a player. But the question is, on Tuesday, the off day, is he going to be in Vegas filming com a commercial or is he going to be watching film and getting the game plan ready? That's the key to becoming a success at quarterback in the NFL. Does he want to do that? Sometimes he says yes. Sometimes he acts the other way. Hit me. Hey there, SI fans. I hope you enjoyed this clip from our daily live show, SI Now. You can find a link to the complete episode in the description box below. And while you're there, make sure you subscribe to Sports Illustrated's YouTube channel. Remember, you can watch SI Now Monday through Friday live at 1 p.m. Eastern time only on SI.com. All right, go along. You ready? Hope to see you there.